704 developing this morning. Investigators still trying to figure out what happened. What cost a good Samaritan his life this morning? Fox 17's Kelly Rippin joins us live from Percy Freestam with where investigators are right now and what they know. A lot of different things took place this morning that led up to uh, one person being held on suspicion of a DUI and a good Samaritan losing his life. To give you guys a little bit of perspective, Percy Priest Dam is just off to our left here. And that uh, is not where this took place, but it kind of gives you a reference point of uh, where we are. We're about downstream of Percy Priest Dam, and what took place was on I-40 westbound. This happened early this morning, about uh, 2 and 3 o'clock is when it happened between, and there were a total of three cars involved. Now, first, a single vehicle accident took place on I-40 westbound. Now, when someone pulled over to see what had taken place, the vehicle was empty. There was no driver. Take a look. We do have some video from early this morning. So a second car pulled up to see what happened, and the two were talking, trying to figure out where the victim of that accident could potentially be. They thought potentially that person fell over the side of the overpass on I-40 westbound. So what police tell us is the driver of one of those cars left his family in the car and jumped over the wall of the overpass in an attempt to save the victim of the accident, likely not realizing how far of a drop that was, possibly thinking there was a uh, ground underneath there. Again, between 2 and 3 o'clock in the morning, very dark, unable to see uh, how far below he was going. Now, rescue crews were called in. Unfortunately, we learned this morning the Good Samaritan did, in fact, die of his injuries. Now, police tell us the driver of that initial single vehicle accident, later found by police in the area, currently being held for driving under the influence, suspicion of driving under the influence. So we're still working to find out more information if that driver will, in fact, be charged and the name of the person who attempted to save the victim of that accident who was not even down there to begin with. Again, the family was on scene of the man that had jumped over the side of the overpass, so they were notified right away. Uh, we're going to continue to follow this story for you this morning, work to get more details about what led up to this series of events. We are live this morning. Kelly Rippin, Fox 17 News. This